بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم نحمده ونصلي على رسوله الكريم So currently we've moved on to section 5 where we are discussing uh, sentences within sentences So we had words, we put those words in sentences then we broke, we studied the main parts of a sentence the mubtada khabar, the fail fail, maf'ul bihi, maf'ul bihi thanin, hal and we said that those can be broken, any of those main slots can be broken out into a, into a phrase. Then we said that the mubtada and certain other words can become a pronoun. Now we are making those slots into sentences. Correct? Anybody following me? Okay. So last song, again we have here jumla ismiya, we have mubtada khabar, mubtada muakhar, khabar muqaddam. Then we have jumla fa'liya, fa'il fa'il, maf'ul bihi, maf'ul bihi thani, maf'ul fi, hal and muta'allik. This is the verb. These are all nouns. Wherever you have a noun, it can be replaced by an unrestricted phrase. And where you have a restricted phrase, it can come from maf'ul fi, the muta'allik or the khabar muqaddam slots. I'll be saying here now, we can have the maf'ul bihi, the maf'ul bihi thanin, the hal, and the khabar as a sentence. Are you following? Okay. Now last time, we had the jumla, we had the jumla ismi as a sentence, jumla fi'li as a sentence. Today we're going to go through having jumla ismi as a sentence, okay? Now, in English, this, this seems a bit weird to us. It, it doesn't add up with our style of, of speech, so it seems a bit weird. But what you can have, you can have a mubtada. You have here, mubtada'un. And then the whole sentence becomes what? Khabar. But the khabar is what? A jumlatun ismiya. So, rahmatuhu is what? Mubtada. So, Allahu. And then mubtada'un. And the wasi'a becomes the khabar. And the rahmatuhu is the mudaf. And the who is the mudafun. Do you understand? Now, somebody must well. So, how do you translate this? Or how, let's see how you don't translate How don't you translate it? You don't say, Allah, his. Mercy is vas. What do you say instead? You join this pronoun. Allah is the same as his, isn't it? So what do you say? Allah's mercy is vast. Now somebody will say, well, why don't we just simply say Rahmatullahi wa si'atun. Rahmatullahi why don't we just say Rahmatullahi wa Asiyatun? Well, there's a benefit, there's a difference. And we'll study this in, when we study Balagha, we'll study that then, inshallah. But Rahmatullahi wa Asiyah, Rahmatullahi wa Asiyah, is different to Allah Rahmatullahi wa Asiyah. There's a difference in the, in the meaning of this. So when you study Balagha, so there's a difference. But now we're not doing that. All we don't know is, well, you can have the sentence, we'll, we'll study these later on. But the Arabs use the structure, Allahu Rahmatuhu wa Asiyah. Zaydun Abuhu Qa'imun. Instead of saying Abu Zaydin Qa'imun, what do you say? Zaydun Abu Qa'imun. That's the way the Arabs speak. And it has some benefit to that. Okay? So you say here, Allah, His mercy is vast. But then, obviously, you say Allah's mercy is vast. And this is a tarqib here, Mubtara Khabar. And then the Khabar is also a, a Mubtara Khabar again. Yes? Following? So that's one part. And again, that is practice. You get used to that. You have exercise. We'll do that later on. Now, one here, we want to skip some Arabic and go to the algebra. So, kana squared plus fail mudar, the square root of fail mudar is what? Who can tell me the answer to this question? No? You're not good at algebra? Arabic algebra? You like English algebra? No? no? You like Arabic algebra? This is Arabic algebra. What does kana plus fail mudar equal? What does that mean? If you have kana and the khabar, you have a fail mudar after it, you will get. A past habitual or past continuous tense? Called algebra, it's like too confusing. No? It's very simple. If I have this example here, كَانَ النَّاسُ يَعْبُدُونَ الْأَسْنَامِ let's, 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 let's just put this in brackets for now and get rid of this. يَعْبُدُونَ الْأَسْنَامِ Okay, يَعْبُدُونَ الْأَسْنَامِ What's يَعْبُدُونَ? فَعْلْ مُضَارِ And كَانَ is كَانَ So now, يَعْبُدُونَ on its own means what? So they are worshipping or they worship. So, so this means you're on its own. 
the worship or it means they are were shipping they worship or they are worshipping but when you have kana you add kana to fa'il mudari the meaning now changes to past continuous they used to do that habitual past continuous habitual sorry they used to do that as a habit in the past they used to worship or past continuous they were worshipping at one point in time and then something else happened so kana when you have a fa'il mudari in the khabar of kana how, what, what does it change into? Past continuous or past habitual. So for example, Kuntum takfuruna billah. So kuntum takfurun. So let's do the keep of this. Kana is what? Fa'ilun naqis. And have the isam as well. The isam is what? The, the tomb. And takfuruna is what? The, the khabar is one word, a phrase, or a sentence? A sentence. This becomes the khabar. And is it, you break that down into what? Fail. And the wa'un nun is what? Fa'il. The wa'u is a fa'il. Now, because we have kana plus mudari, what does that mean here? What does that translate as? You used to. This believe. You see? You used to disbelieve. Another example. Kuntum tushrikun. Ashraka yushriku ishrakan. To ascribe partners. So kuntum tushrikun. You used to ascribe partners. You see? Because kana. Kana plus fail mudari equals used to. Do you understand? Kanu yakzibun. How do you say kanu yakzibun? They used to lie. Kanu yakfuruna bi ayatillah. They used to disbelieve in the signs or the verse of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Do you understand? So, just two things we discussed today. One is the khabar can also come as a jumla ismiya. So, the khabar can come as a word, a phrase, a jumla ismiya or fa'liya. And then, if the khabar is jumla fa'liya wa fa'il mudari, and it has kana plus mudari, what does it equal? Pass? Pass habitual or pass? Continuous. Okay? Subhanallah wa bihamdi, subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika, wa nashadu an la ilaha illa anta, wa nasakfiruka, wa natubu ilayk.